So is jumping on a mini trampoline bad for your low back and bad for the discs in your back? I'm Dr. Wendy, I'm a physical therapist, and I have taken care of women for almost 20 years. And let me tell you about why this may or may not be bad for your back. So actually a small percentage of low back pain is actually from the discs in your lumbar spine, your low back. The posterior annulus is the back part of the disc, and I like to think of it as many thin layers of ligaments. Now we know that the body has lots of tendons, fascia, ligaments, and all of these things have what we call mechanoreceptors in them. Our body is meant to move. Now, the discs in the back are a little bit unique and they're a little bit different, but the way they get nutrition is actually through movement. And so as you move your body, you are actually helping nutrition get into that disc. Now on the flip side of that coin, we also need to rest. We need to lay down, we need to be on our back. You know, but I wouldn't be afraid of doing gentle jumping on a mini trampoline because the gentle movements, if you are not vigorously jumping, and of course, as people stay within their safe range, it actually could be very helpful in you gaining strength, getting nutrition, and moving your body. Movement is medicine, but I always tell my patients to stay within their pain-free range, but I wouldn't be afraid of jumping on a mini trampoline. I actually think it would be a good choice. Now, in a different realm of moving your body, there is something called whole body vibration. We know that that is helpful for many, many different things. And I would suggest people who have chronic non-specific low back pain, which is a majority of people, that is from pain and inactivity and the fascia in the low back has a lot of pain receptors and doesn't get to move. So I wouldn't be so worried about the discs. I would be more worried about not moving and losing muscle bulk. Hit the plus sign and follow for more women's health and wellness tips. Bye.